you get an extra heart um, piece on that side. You! The arse is in the house, baby, and... What the fuck? I accidentally hit the fucking... Okay. The arse in the house, baby, welcome back next episode of Future Less, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Let's just get on with this gameplay. While I was doing a little grinding in this game, I managed to get oh, at least 400 rupees in this case. Because, um... I had a little mess up oh, off screen. I see twice. Like, I was going after the red and I'm um, purple repeat all things again. As before, it just slipped out just twice. Nothing too much. I got the rest on easily. So, anyway, as we continue our little adventure, let's go to the shop. Like I said before, we're going to go to the shop and do a little side quest mission while we're at it. So, I can get that done over it. So, like, right now, you can also steal from the item if you want to. I'm going to be showing it off. Like, after I save. First, I'm gonna be, um, oh, um, oh, get this item. <laughs> and yes, uh, um, they kept it to, um, the traditional life by playing with shovel stuff. Like, the shovel is in this game. And you can get it for 200 rupees. Same goes on heart piece. This actually, I believe it's new. I don't remember seeing that before. So, this is new. So, you had to get the 200 rupees for this one. As for the bombs and, uh, arrows and shit. I don't see the bombs in this game yet. Because, like, um, it just shows up there. So, what I'm gonna do is save, and let's uh, show you guys what happens if you end up um, getting yourself killed in the progress. Because, like, I'm gonna load up the game if I die. So, all you have to do is carry this item. Nope. Because, like, if he, if he catches you, if he catches you like that, then he's gonna uh, force you to pay. Wait, no, uh, if he, um... No, fuck. Ah, shit. Cause, like, if he, uh, if he catches you like this... Hey, 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 I'm trying to show off to the audience. Hey! hey come on! Do that on the last play, I'll let you guys know. Well, other than that, let's just get on with this gameplay. says something about Pokey. Basically, um, I believe that's what the statue's all, all about from what I picked up on the last episode, because, um, I believe if you put something there, you'd be able to unlock something, I don't know. I I'm gonna try it out later in the future if I see something, like, I'll something to it. Front plant. Oh, wait, 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 I, I saw another, uh, I'll, I saw another stand up ahead, so let's see what we got here. It says uh, something about Goomba. Okay. So, this is basically a new feature. Like, let's see what the what happens if you end up going to the house and placing it there. Because I know that um, the lady uh, Meow Meow uh, has something like that, so much for it. It says it's uh, Bow Wow. Not the Chia Chia. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mr. Receiver. <coughs> Hi, Mr. Receiver. Fizzer, 
or carrying a vivid uh, on their person. I mean, defending in a dark house on my premise. My chick baby, I'm Xiao Xiao. Xiao Xiao, I just don't know how to pronounce it sometimes. Xiao Xiao has been uh, pinning an uh, new accessory. Okay, so basically, we just want to go over here and get this done. I want to get that outside crystal wrath. Makeup, gels, dresses, I put it all! Oh, the fiffin! I need it! Will you try it all for my dye friend? Lucky! Thanks! Well, here's your dog food! Oh, scrunches. I just love a can of juicy, a juicy beef. Okay. Now that's taken care of. I didn't see any uh, statue stand for that one, so. Is there any statue stand around here? Something I need to be aware of. This one over here. Cheap, cheap. Oh, oh I, saw I saw another one over there. Let me go, Let me go back. Go back. Says, blooper. God damn it! What's well, so fucking important to have these fucking statues? I could go to that uh, involves on uh, CSEA. No. Okay, let's just go on with a little adventure. I, I wasted enough time. Let's just move on with our little adventure. Oh, I found all. We'll go back to that library later. Oh, I'm gonna go this way. Again, I, I said in the last episode, I just woke up around 5 uh, a.m. and so I just got you know, things set up. So I just want to get uh, this gameplay going. Why? Well, Why? Well, I can't. Because, like, I want to save as much footage as, as I possibly can. Because, like, normally I wouldn't be doing that, like, stopping in the middle of the progress. Then, next thing you know, my computer freezes on me, and all of a sudden I have no uh, face in footage. That pissed me off a lot. So they basically keep it true to, uh, to their tradition. I like that. Because, um, basically, if you play this game, it's like saying, Oh, this is, uh, is it the same as before? It's like, not the fucking fire was almost hit me. So, like, um, as soon as you come across uh, this game, it's like, Oh, this is gonna, uh, is Nintendo gonna keep true to the original? And pretty much they did. Even though they have some new um, remix and stuff all added to this game, I really do like the adaptation of this game. And uh, as I as I mean by the tradition to the traditional, you hear that little uh, uh, tune music that you about to get come across that item, like that a key or something. Whew. Yeah, I definitely need some coffee. <laughs> So basically, the game said you take twice as damage. Uh, I'm very careful with that. But like, normally it just takes like uh, half of your heart, but this one it takes like twice as hard. Well, it's not as bad as uh, the one from the Link Awakening. Wait, wait, no, this is a Link Awakening. I mean, like, uh, Link Between Worlds. That's what I meant to say for the 3DS version. Cause like when I play the hard mode of uh, Link Between Worlds, they take twice your heart, not the um. Not half of no, your full heart and shit. You gotta watch out for that. Because, um. Um. Because, like, if you're not careful with that, you get easily dodge it onto the enemies. Okay. So, I would love to have a bomb for that part, but uh, I don't have a bomb. I can't even find a bomb in a shop. Because, even though I do go to the back of the shop, I'll say it's not gonna give me a bomb immediately. I think I have to find it like uh, in later in the game, so so I'm gonna have to go along with it. But I don't know, I got the sea shell down there a long time ago, those who haven't played it. Okay, um My apologies. I really don't like drowning in my left place and such. But um it's like oh, fuck me. I really don't like yarning on my last play, but um, again, I haven't had my coffee and stuff. Like, I haven't gone to Starbucks yet, so I ain't gonna worry about that. And even if you do bounce on the Goombas, 
Yeah, you can bounce them up, but you don't get no hearts from them. Oh, you do get a piece of heart, though. That already ever happens. And you can't give me no extra heart for that either. Oh, that's some dick move, Nintendo. Fine, go we'll play your way. I just need to uh, encrypt this bad boy on me. And also, while we're at it, I'm gonna save. You know what? I should have been down to the Bowser's house and actually uh, got the fucking. Yeah, I got the shell for a reason. I forgot about that. I'll take it out. So I'll come back there later. I gotta keep that in mind. So, Link is being able to jump. I like to keep the uh, jump button on the X, on the X function because like. And watch you playing uh, Link's Between Worlds, or not, not Link's Between Worlds, uh, all Breath of the Wild series. No. Come here. Oh, shit. Oh, almost got hit by that thing. Well, I ain't getting that rupee. Fuck that. You're like, um, when you go after the boss in this game, you guys do a spin slash attack um, for two hits. And that's how I killed it the first time. That, that was amazing how that did that the first time. If you don't believe me, I'll throw it off to you guys. Oh shit. We gotta watch out for that. I wonder if there's a special reward you can play on uh, you can get after beating this game in uh, hero mode. I mean, I'm, I'm really trying it out myself. I mean, I play a lot of games in the hard difficulty because, like, I like to challenge myself. At least, it, uh, at least try to make it fair for me. Give me a fair fight. Cause, like, if I like, down to my own, uh, one heart left, then, oh, uh, if I'm down to my one last heart, uh, for me to survive, then what I need to do is to, like try to give me a fairy on uh, standby and also use her um to heal me. Not eating her. This uh, have her use her magic to heal me completely. Oh, while we're at it, we're gonna all head to the far right because like there's nothing out there except for that stone beak. I ain't gonna worry about that. And hey, this motherfucker is all squishy looking. No! I gotta be careful because like I could die easily. Don't you dare touch me! Come here! Shit. 
At least let me see the secret ending after you let's see for no death run. Even though you guys clearly saw me die and my friend. At least give me that. Okay, so what you gotta do is try to do a spin slash attack on um, twice. And that's it. Rupees for that. That's very safe than sorry, I suppose. And a beautiful cello. Got the full moon cello. Now, play us a beautiful music for us, please. Nowadays, like, don't appreciate really good music or an, or a certain good musical instrument anymore, cause um, these like to go along with hip hop and all that shit, and something that's really dirty. It's like, do you want to just fucking go along with it? Swamp, a path opens and it blooms. Go there. So yeah, like, even nowadays, like to go a shit ton of hip hop music. Like, there's nothing wrong with some certain hip hop music. Like, it's like. My father or my family just don't like that kind of music a lot. Like, honestly, because they, they say it's not real music. I kind of stand the reason why. Woo! That is Isaac Cyrus. Are hey, you over talking about the family's so history of not liking hip hop? What's wrong with you? Hey, 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 hey! You stay out of it. You get me out of that kind of crap. I have to admit that I first did not believe you actually succeed. Even though know, you did die, so you. Did, it also comes to the dead kill. Fuck you. As long as you have it to save him below, you don't- it doesn't count. I'll tell them to the viewers out there. You must collect them all. Collect all the instruments and I'll give you destruction. <laughs> Next, you gotta go to the point of swamp. I hit there. Okay, whatever. This is- it, it, this is- go. Shoot, shoot. Alright, so now that we got that out of the way, and I'll also let's head down to the beat again. Because, um, I wanted to get this cypress out. I get the cyclist missing down the way immediately. So, head over here and talk to this gator man. What, do I have to like find the bombs uh, in a dungeon somewhere? Or oh, what? What's that you have here? It's canned uh, food! <clears throat> My bad, I didn't get that far. Hey, for heaven's sake, man, give that to me, please! I'm gonna lose it if I don't- I can't get that, can? Fine, have it. Oh, thank you. I'll take that. God damn, man. You just ate the whole cake completely. That was great. I know it's not fair trade, but here's some bananas. Yum. You prefer meat over our fruit, apparently. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Is there anything I can get over here? I don't think I can, as far as I'm aware of. Lucky don't throw burnt uh, coconuts at me. Yeah, I can't get that yet. Cause like, that's where the roof is just located at. So, even if I do be one of the mini game um, bosses it says, I don't get no fairy. That is a fucked up dick move there, Nintendo, really. I mean, I understand that you're not gonna give us a hard piece dropping down it, I get it, but if you're not gonna give us a fairy, at least give us a fair shot of surviving. That's a dick move, by the way. Anyway, what do we have here? Hey, mommy, it's serious! Yeah, I'm all serious! Really, really serious! Yeah, it is! The real moments! The moments came to the garage! Yeah, that's right, the whole king of moments! That, that's for real! They all came to the house! Yeah, the house! It might be faster if we find out for our, uh, ourselves what the hell's happened. Let's go check out this little library real fast. That basically what you need is like a dashboard for you to get that item. Cause like I tried going down to the area where the cemetery is at and try to unlock in the uh, the route. 
Like, again, uh, there's no Game Boy system, but all of a sudden, it, it's like, I'm gonna ignore you, because I already know the situation. But, I'm gonna go inside this house, though. So, like, even if you do know the combination yourself, the game's not gonna let you in until you actually, um... Uh, the game's not gonna let you in until you actually come across, um... The book. Oh, sorry. You have to come across a book in order for you to uh, uh, unlock the secret area. Uh, oh, you're not, you're not allowed to go there, period. Oh, 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 I just I just noticed the second statue over there. Oh, don't know about that. Okay, let's just go over there real fast. It says for... Oh, that's where it goes to. Yeah, let's place it here. Okay, um, okay, uh, I wonder if there's anything special if you do something like that, like, if you unlock something really special along the way, like, I don't know, just fucking collect all of them, do they give you a special reward or something, a special seashell, heart piece, whatever, oh, there's a Goomba right there, uh, you know what, this is my little game right here, so let's just get it, after I get the rupees. I'm guessing if you know, uh, do stuff like that on a mini game, you have to uh, play a train game in order to get the statue. Like, you don't get them off the worlds and stuff, so basically you do stuff like that. I wonder if you can get more rupees after doing something like that. Like, um, if you end up uh, collecting all the statue and placing it in the right appropriate spot, then what happens? Do you get the, uh, more rupees, like 100 rupees or 200 rupees? That'd be cool. If so, then I can definitely grind for that. Unless the game cooperates with me. I'm gonna have to do that next time when it comes to me um, playing off-screen. Like, um, like, I'll come back to this game. Oh, uh, let me see. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna go to the second dungeon, beat that one, and then off-screen by collecting all the statues, let you guys know I got all the statues on the line. And place them in their little spots. Alright, so let's just go out to this one. I'm gonna go to the far end right here. So I'm gonna wait for it. I'm gonna wait for it. Oh, um, Jerry comes this direction. And go. And you go. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. You better stay in there. Alright, good. So I'm pretty sure there's another statue you get after you all um, put, put it in an appropriate spot. I just hit it when the game takes me over for all uh, for my victory. So yeah, like let me see if my theory is right, if you do something like that. Cause like, I'm pretty sure the first time we're gonna try to play this game, go out the statue, it's like, um... He just like, have a hard time playing this game, um, oh, for the, for the patience. Like, you have to be very patient with it. And I get it. Cause like, it's not that easy. Okay, so I got the statue there or the figure. It's like, kinda reminds me of the Bonica figure from Resident Evil 4. Oh. I'll take that. Um. Oh, what the fuck? They don't show it anymore? I might have to play the uh, game one more time, so I'll be right back. Alright, is there. Oh, uh, after I get the big card and it says. No, it's the same. Okay. Let's go back to the swamp. And I'll meet you back over there. Like, oh, where we can cross the bridge. So I'll meet you there. Oh. That's new. I completely forgot about that. I don't know if I did that in my last one's playing on, uh, the, on the Game Boy version. Oh well, at least I knew where it was that, back then. Oh, yeah. By the way, how many do I have? I only got shit on four of those cells. And now that I got back on close to the rich area, let's head over this direction. Okay, we got some harpies. How many harpies do I have exactly? Oh, yeah, one. It would have been a fourth one, but I just basically bought one of my, um, 
Uh, Chris Stanley. Also, this is the house where the photos are used to be at. House of War at it. Let's head over here. Before we head down to the mall for the zone area, I'm afraid to go over there right now. I'm gonna have it. I can't even. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. I like the uh, feature that when you jump, you got to do it all uh, uh, horizontal. Shit, you can do that to do it all uh, air slash attack. I like that attack right there. Horizontal is up and down, vertical is left and right. So it's basically a horizontal slash, I think. Alright, so. I'm gonna save. And make sure I don't die, I can complete boom. Get on this little story, because I did die to him once. <laughs> Getting into more thing about it, I should have saved that fucking heart for you more think about it. Uh, eh? Who's the suspicious looking friend? Okay, boys, let's get rid of him. This is gonna be a little tough, because, um. Regardless of the situation, I want to survive this. The game's not that up. It's kind of hard for me to all oh, invade him when he's like this. Like, ow! Oh, at least I got this on me. Burning it doesn't help out. You must be assassin sent by Madame Mermaid to rescue the Mutt. I came, uh, you came here to get me, but it's I who will get you. You gotta watch out for now. He's kinda hard for you to avoid. So like, make it, make sure you get him close enough uh, for you to have to attack you. When it comes to uh, ramming attack. Otherwise, if he's like a fall far away from he's attacking you, also he's just gonna like stop in the middle of uh, section. I guess in, I've been uh, not allowing him to uh, hit the wall like he move, because I kept jumping. Yeah, I, I believe that every time I keep jumping, he's gonna stop immediately. I tried jumping over him once, I tried to but he just stopped completely. So just basically let him run after you, and while you're on the ground, just don't jump. That's how you guys do. Okay, that actually did better than last time. Hey, don't try to attack me. I'm trying to save your ass. Okay, so, yeah, I did a lot better than last time. I actually appreciate that. Because the last time I did it, I tried jumping over that uh, Moblin leader, and all of a sudden, he just kept stopping in the middle of the progress, and just don't jump whenever he starts charging at you, because like, he's going to stop and not hit the wall. Oh, it looks like that fucking statue is moving his mouth. Ooh, 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 that is a fearsome beast. That is a fearsome beast. So hopefully that thing doesn't eat me. Hopefully he eats you. Fuck off. Okay. okay. We'll worry about that house later in the future. That's the uh, crazy Tracy. Actually, the more I think about it, Crazy Tracy most likely having items on me in order for me to buy. I just had to give you the Gexus style um, groupies for that and get the bracelet for that. Thankfully, I'll explain that later. Okay, I'm Jeffy. My job is I'll run this island to dig up some interesting stuff. When you have some time to spare, come to uh, see me at the shack over there. Yeah, we're gonna worry about that later, because even if I have Bow Wow with me, it's not gonna allow me to actually interact with them right now. So, I'm thankful for this game. That um, you don't have to worry about switching items for the call, uh, the bracelet. Thank God, cause like I fucking hate that mechanic. Oh yeah, viral. Sick and girl. Now you hate that motherfucker all. If that thing's attached to my chest, I don't have boobs. I just, I just find that satisfying how my dog just eats that thing completely in one gulp. Eat it! That's basically the scary thing to go through, like you, you basically, uh, oh wait, wait, I forgot. And it also had that feature that you can actually dig hair. I like that feature. Oops. Cause like, um, uh, when, uh, Bawa lets you know that the seven feet of dig there, and all of a sudden you can actually, like, dig, dig to a certain area, then all of a sudden, you can find yourself a seashell. So I got me five seashells, so that's basically a good thing. It is Mr. Wright, by the way. Well, 
Well, I pretty much uh, stick to myself. Me and my letters. My name's right. My face right. No, just right. The only thing I don't, don't like about my hobby is that I never receive any response. The more I think about it, on the side quest mission, I think I'll say true for having a little uh, catfishing photo like Princess Peach picture in it. I'd love to see that. Okay, it's like like. Yeah, we got some eat alive. Second girl. Sake, I'm not gonna start over again and also have to start dealing with that bullshit circumstance that died on the progress. So anyway, like I really am happy with the Nintendo dip for this game. Like, as soon as you get used to a bracelet in this game, all of a sudden it stays on you for I said I'll grab an item. Like, all you do is Ow. All you had to do is just grab an all an item and I'll by pressing A. That's all you gotta do. You don't have to worry about switching at all. Just die, you little bastard. And that, that's what makes it a lot easier. And yes, also the, the, the characters like um, the Piranha Plants and the uh, Shy Guys, they're in this game too. Actually, the more I think about it, the only way you activate them, uh, uh, to get those statues, uh, the, those figures, you have to come across the enemies at least once. I just came across the Shy Guys, so I'm most likely to have a statue for that thing. I can call it a statue, but it's most like a statue figure. So this is all along with it. Okay, so we already know if this is a dead end on the far right, so I even know this is a key we can get later. But I ain't gonna worry about that right now. And we got some grammy from motherfucker. Just keep blocking, you should be fine. Alright, now I got a piece of power. I'm gonna get this key. Actually, I don't need to worry about getting the second key um, up ahead if I want to. I mean, I can just ignore it completely, but fuck it. I'm gonna collect everything as much as I can just for me to, uh... Mm, excuse me. I'll collect everything as much as I can in order for me to survive and enjoy the gameplay. You don't have to worry about hitting the switch, by the way, in case you're wondering, because, um, that just, um, that just handles your brow if you want to go any further. So, stand from, uh, do, uh, stand from behind, do a spin slash, and you're good to go. Uh, again, I'm just double checking on my face cam, make sure I don't fucking freeze everything. The next thing you know, my face cam just doesn't work completely, and then uh, my computer is like completely frozen. That's just gonna piss me off a lot. Uh, it'll piss off anybody if you try to do a face cam footage. You don't have to worry about going to the far on left if you don't want to. I mean, I can do it later on when I, after I beat one of the uh, mini bosses. Oh shit, I almost fell off like an idiot. I know some of you guys are hoping for that, but I'm not trying to do that on so purposely. 
Alright, take this. Take your ass out. And it's going forward. Alright, next we're gonna put Sassy here. <coughs> and yes, um, this is the dungeon I came across before my whole face kind of froze on me. That, that is a dick move for the computer to do. I mean, my laptop is really old and stuff. It could barely keep up with me. Hey, I, I gotta stand that. So, I can't do anything about it if I can uh, upgrade it myself. So, I mean, I could if I want to, I just don't know how to do it properly with the processor and, and all of a sudden I just fuck shit up. And you get an uh, extra heart um, piece on that side. You! You stay away from me, motherfucker. Oh! You're not gonna kill me again like you did last time. Oh no! Ow! Well, at least I got fell in a hole. That's sad. But history repeats itself. I'll be right back. I saved earlier, so I'm gonna be right back. Alright, we're back. Even though I lost one of my heart like a complete dumbass. Like, you remember the little spinies that, um, monster I dealt with with the shield? Yeah, I jumped up after him so instead of just, uh, blocking. That was my bad. Anyway. Yeah, get with this bastard again. I will totally love to use bow and arrow with this fucking monster. Ow! No, I'm not falling for that again! Fuck you! Kill me earlier! I'm not doing that again a second time! I'm gonna be smart about this. Oh, wait, 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 wait! I forgot to count them. Yeah, I think, you know what? I might as well come over here anyway. I was supposed to get the bracelet. Bullshit! Fuck that! Nope! Like, I want to get the bracelet, kill myself first, and then go see Crazy Tracy. Cause like, um, like, I have the bottle for a reason. I'm not gonna let it go to waste when I'm not on using it. And this is what the statue is located at. So I thought. I just played this game a while, but I forgot this like was a dome. Oh, fucking. Oh. I forgot the fucking races location. Boy. Okay, now I got me some 20 rupees, that's good. Now I'm gonna deal with fucking uh, Teresa, aka the booze. No! Save me for this spot where I die. I kill that thing instead of me going after it the second time. Or third time this game. No! Oh! You're testing my patient, game. You stay the hell away from me, you fucking bats. Or in this case, they're keys. But I call you bats anyway. Go ahead. They're not doing your punk asses. Just let me make it by you guys. <laughs> Fuck you. Ugh. Okay. I was saying earlier that there, those ghosts are known as serrations in Japanese, but they call booze in the English version. And now that I got the power braces, let me just get me the hell out of here. I really need a fucking healing item. I, I can't stress it if I need a healing item. But like, that is a dick move for the tend to do, like, not long as I heal ourselves, and all of a sudden we have to deal with that kind of bullshit. And I remember 
correctly, I ended up playing this game on the uh, Game Boy version. I don't remember collecting uh, this fucking uh, chest. I said to myself I did, and now I do. I don't remember collecting it on the last time I played it. So, I'm going to try to be very careful. Oh, damn. And I really need the uh, power bracelet for this one, because fuck me, I need um, to lift up rocks. The game's not allowing me to do stuff like that easily. Unless it was like a boulder around your side or something, then I can understand the reason why. Also, we got a little tough case this one right here. Crazy, crazy! I need to talk to you! Oh. Nice place. Mind if I break a pod? You just did stupid. Oh, great. Okay. Crazy Tracy. Hi, my big guy. I'm Crazy Tracy. I got a little secret for sale and I'll pop you up. Will you, get, will you give me 28 rubies for my secret? Sure. <laughs> all right. Come here and I'll rub her all in there. There. I'll find my own secret medicine. I'll take that fact to lose all your heart. Now don't buy again. Okay, so that's that's good. Okay. Here's the old bonus treatment. Behold, my heart, your heart's a full of gold, a fully recovered. So basically, it's like this: secret medicine. So what happens that if you have that on you, uh, you're guaranteed to restore yourself if you die. If you have the bottle, you can't even fucking cover yourself with the uh, with the fairy if you die. That's bullshit. I can't understand the reason they kept the tradition alive for doing that. I get that part. Also, while we're at it, let's head over this direction real fast, cause um, uh, I want to see if I can get the fucking item. Just give me one moment. We'll get back to the dungeon shortly. I want to uh, take care of this shit. Yeah, like uh, around the on the far right side, just behind me. Basically, if you end up going to that. Are you fucking kidding me? Like, if you go down to this direction, this is a secret um, dungeon you can head over there that uh, only exists on the, the Game Boy Color version. And they put that back in there. I like that. That also means I'm gonna give me the, uh, I'm gonna give me a powerful uh, tunic that allows me to do a double the damage. I like that. And then once you get the, uh, the piece of power, then you guys can do triple the da uh, quadruple the damage. Cause like, oh, fuck. Don't die! Get my way, Bow Wow. You can also do like put two of damage so you get a piece of power. That Bow Wow just knocked his ass over like it was nothing. Alright, get my way. You just go out to this and it's on dig right here. Thank you, Bow for telling me that. Yeah, it's like I said earlier, like, I'm thankful that Nintendo actually did this part that you don't have to worry about switching items every single time just to lift up the fucking, um, um, objects and shit. And I also appreciate Bow for eating that fucking, um, choo choo. So I don't have to worry about attacking him myself. No one said that he's gonna be short lived for me to spend time with Bow Wow. Alright, so I'm gonna say. And I'm not gonna end the episode here. At least I got that. But like every time I die, all of a sudden I had to deal with this bullshit. This got some some random bullshit I had to put up with. Oh, burning ink! I just noticed that. But like, um, I just know I just barely noticed that by the time I killed that fast. I can't even get that thing. Lower your ass over here real fast. This is where you get the zone beam. I believe I ignored it last time. Yeah, you just get the stone beam. That's how you get the stone beam, so you don't have to worry about that too much. No. Yet! Thank you, Gun Burning Acorn, because at least I can just out heal myself. Oh, wait, like, at least save my health for him. I'll get taken multiple damage like that. For low guy, I died too much in this game. I don't want to die again. Go away. 
gonna move upstairs real fast. And if I remember correctly, this is what a oh, prime has are located at. So I like the uh, the upper slash attack. I really like that. The horizontal slash. It's too bad I can't even fucking uh, cry no hearts every time I stop with those motherfucking Goombas. At least give us that Nintendo! I know you're doing a normal difficulty, but fuck! Okay, as we were correctly for the previous gameplay, what we had to do is, um, come across this one, lift this, hit the, hit the buddy first, I don't know what the fuck that thing really is, hit the Queen Reaper, and hit that last. I got it backwards. Ow! Cause like, you can't attack him with a sword. You fuck. Cause like every time you attack him with a sword, also it's not gonna uh, let you do that. Hit the bat or the key. I don't care what you call it. All oh, key. I'm still calling it bat. Correct. And that's it. I keep doing that backwards. I don't know why I keep doing that. Okay. Now we get that taken care of. We get the boss key. Uh, do I need an extra key for this on the right? Yes, I do. Not the bats! Not the keys! Yep, I should have up in here first. Or I can just hit the switch right here. Fuck off. Ooh, he's about. Knocks his ass out like completely. So I'm gonna head over this direction real fast. And I can't even get no hearts in it, considering that it's not allowing me to do that. So I'm gonna head over here. Hit this. Hit the key. And head, head on out of here. Oh, God. I know. The Cyclops was pretty much the same thing as it did before, at least I didn't fell to my death in the hole. All you did is toss me aside. That one was a comedy go right there, I'm not gonna lie. Even though I was laughing at myself when I was editing this video, uh, that video. And like, it basically, when I constantly showed off my debut video, so that basically I want to show it off to my audience, on my newcomer audience, who is curious about what my uh, show is all about. So basically, the tradition is the same as ever. All you have to do is stand on this stone. And it's, um... Also, this all, that stone on the platform right there has a face to make, uh, make us up heavier. And this is as far as I haven't gotten to, so, uh, to be honest, because, um... Like, after I um, realized that my face canvas was completely frozen and shit, I was really pissed off. I, was, I, I can't even do anything about that. And on top of that, it's like, uh, my computer was all completely frozen, so there's nothing much I can do. This fucking uh, clown right here. Oh ho ho! I'm your bad guy this time! Ho ho ho! At least I got me a call uh, called Cream Madison for me to survive, genie. At least, uh, I will admit the game actually gave us a name of who they're called. Instead of just guessing what they call, who they are. Yes. So, whatever you do is attack when he goes back inside his pod. Oh, I can't move! But I'm still all right. Your little sword won't break this bottle. Even if um, the walls don't have hair that look tough enough that uh, I think you can. Uh huh. Thanks for giving me a little hint, you shit. Yeah, yeah, you can't hurt me as long as I have the white bottle. If it was a lamp, it was a whole other story. Oh shit, that motherfucker was that me. Alright, where's the repeat? Pick this up. Boom. There should be one more uh, attack to do something like that. Wait till you start uh, throwing frame balls at ya. Ooh, watch out for that. You don't want to get caught. Alright. That's it. Ah! You! Oh, but you, you make me hopping mad. Woo! I'm hopping mad. Oh shit! Oh! Ow! Oh no! No! I got my medicine. 
with me this time. But yeah! Thank God um, for, for Tracy, okay, I'm crazy Tracy. I really need that medicine. Cause like, I wasn't scared uh, to be hit by a fireball, I don't think he started stalking me. And just like that, when I got myself full health, I really needed full health for um, the heart piece I need to get. Alright, I'll go back to Crazy Tracy. I really need her. For this list, but I really fucking need her. I, she's, she's the love of my life. Even though she's a super girly girl, but whatever. The Conscious Mourn. Well, let us hear the little music of Conscious Mourn to, go, to be played. Not bad. Okay, I'm gonna end this episode here for now. Cause, whew. Now, prayer. Prairie. A prairie. Uh, the prairie is raining. Oh, mm. woof. Oh, mother. Woof. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah. So, I'm gonna end this episode here for now. And, um, by the time I come back, I'm gonna go talk to Tron, Crazy Tracy, and then later on, um, I'm gonna meet you back outside our house, and while we're at it, this is... Oh, I got this whole place all covered up completely. Even I haven't been to Tall Heights down to the right yet, but I basically cleared the whole area, so thank you guys for watching my channel, if you like the... Sorry. Still sorry about that. I need my coffee. So if you guys like the channel, hit the like and subscribe button. And if you do like it, and hit the little notification button to let you know more updates of my videos will come up. Until until next time, I'm Infinity Game Crusher, and Arthur says, catch y'all next episode, baby. Peace.